Hey, welcome to the Gizmo Times Tips channel and uh, this is the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro that comes with uh, a dual lens camera combination on the back, the Snapdragon 636 processor which can well do the 4K video recording but by default this phone does not come with a 4K video recording option and if you go into the settings you will notice uh, that it is not able to take 4K videos. The video quality at best what you can do here is full HD video recording. So in this video we will talk about how to do the 4K videos on the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro. For that there is an application called as Open Camera which is available uh, for free on the Google Play Store. And uh, this is that application. You need to just download that. It's just 1.5 uh, MB file size. And as soon as you do that you can now go to this and uh, you'll see loads and loads of options. Not that this might be the best application but then at least it gives you the option to take 4K videos. If you enter the settings, uh, these are the settings for the photo and video. Go into the video settings and uh, set the resolution for the videos. You will see that the highest is 4K video Ultra HD, 38, uh, 14 to 2160 pixels and it's 16 to 9 at 8.29 MP. You can also enable the video stabilization which is uh, another thing. There is EIS support if you turn this option. So electronic event stabilization, that's the software based stabilization that is possible with this. Now you can go to this and uh, go to the video option, allow open camera. And once you start the recording, it is now recording. It is a bit slower than what you see on the basic camera, but then again, there should be some compromises because by default you don't see the 4K video options. This was a quick tip on how to record 4K videos with the rear camera of the Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro using the open camera application. There might be a few other applications as well. Uh, there might be a lot of uh, ways you can uh, try to do it. But then open camera is one of the easiest ways to capture 4K videos on the smartphone that supports it. So stay tuned for more videos, so subscribe for more and uh, do ask if you have any other questions. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.